so let me say, Tevis has been around for 40 years or more. I mean, this is a long time. It's a company that's reliable, that's trustworthy, that's been around doing this for long enough to understand how to do it. Money. Do I have your attention yet? I know I do. Every time we say money, everyone's eyes perk up and go, ooh, what do you mean? What are we getting at? What are we doing? Well, I'm with Michael today. We're talking Tevis. And the first question I'm gonna ask, and don't worry, we will get some money very, very soon because that's why we're all really in this business, aren't we? But the first question I'm gonna ask, because we all kind of wanna know this as well, is what do you do? Oh, good question, Tony. What do we do? Let me rephrase this. What do companies look for? What are the what they what they're trying to aspire when they when they do their work, their daily work? And I got to say this: every owner, every president is manufacturing a part. They have machines, they've got tools, they got software. At the end of the day, when they're looking at their books, they're trying to save as much money as they possibly can. And they're trying to make as much revenue as possibly that they can, so that they can grow. So essentially, what Tebas does is provide them power, money. How do we do this? By giving them the best possible tool to be successful in their daily work. By giving them simulation tools so they can keep their machines as safe as possible. It's almost like you getting a new car. What happens when you got your first scratch on that car? All hands off. Drive it, drive it till the, till the wheels fall off. So keeping those machines as new as possible and, and, and operating at their peak, that's the goal for every single company. And that's saving them money, optimizing their tool pass inside the simulation, knowing exactly what's going on. Everybody has this, this word called digital twin. Mm -hmm. And that's one of those things that having the exact machine model inside, inside your computer, estimating what's going on, uh, eliminating crashes, eliminating uh, no machining that's going on because the machine's staying in the limits, that's saving them money. But on top of it, what if I could tell you that Tebas can save them money by getting their machines in an optimized type of operation so that they can get their jobs off the machine as quickly as possible. Because what can they do then? They can put the next jobs in and the next jobs. They can get to their milestones, the delivery dates a lot quicker. And getting that all done, Tebas does this with optimized strategies, with optimized tool paths, with strategies that make sense. We always say in our business, if you cut in the air, you're not making money. That's absolutely correct. Now, I heard a rumor, Michael. I got to clarify this. The got audience it. loves a good customer testimonial, the, the truth of what our words mean, right? When mm -hmm. we come out, is it true that you helped a client, a partner, a friend of yours start producing so much product that some of their machines would actually need more power because they were always up running? How, what are the details of that story? It's unbelievable. But I got to say is. this. So this happened on Monday. Monday, I'm down here, I get an email from one of my colleagues and says, I, I just need to tell you this. We have this client and I can't say the name yet, so please keep it in the back of your mind. It will come out very soon. But we have this client that joined Tebas. He switched over from another competitive solution in April. We're now in November. So in our check-in on Friday, this owner was so ecstatic and when he told us the story, we couldn't believe this. And the story is the following. He has doubled since April, his throughput on his, on his machines. His parts are coming off the machines a lot quicker. His machine uptime is close to 90% now in efficiency. Wow. But the interesting thing is what you already alluded to. He was wondering why he's tripping his breakers on his building so often. So he got DTE to come in, our electric company in Michigan. And he was wondering why that is happening. He thought something is wrong with the line. In their analysis, they found out that they're pulling too much power now into the building because the machines are running so much now that he needs to get another transformer in order to push more power into the building. Uh, wow. it's, it's, 
It's a nice little problem to have. It sure is. But that's reality. And that's a real life story. And uh, it's gonna come out very quickly of, of who that individual is and what we've done. And it's, it's fact. Tebas provides customers the ability to just be more profitable. Now, another subject I'd love to bring up with you, Michael, if it's okay, and it's oftentimes a sensitive subject because it deals with money. Mm -hmm. and, and we started this conversation off about making money, but sometimes we think about something's out of my price range or I can't afford it. And sometimes it's new technology for us. But first thing, just let me say, Tevis has been around for 40 years or more. I mean, this is a long time. It's a company that's reliable, that's trustworthy, that's been around doing this for long enough to understand how to do it. I know, I know it sounds a little bit redundant when I say do it, do it again, again. However, it's important to understand 40 years, right? Yeah. Now, I also understand that there's conversations that go on in all these shops. I know you guys out there, we have these conversations about spending money and they think, well, maybe I can't afford Tevis. Tevis is that elite type of platform that, yeah, I can get twice as much, up to 90% efficiency. I can get twice as much work out the door, but it's going to cost me. And how long before I get that return on investment, oh, yeah. Michael? But current modern truths are that a lot of these numbers are really similar. And Tevis is not only affordable on the front end, but obviously going to make us money on the back end really quickly. Yeah. Would you like to touch on that a little bit? You know, pe people have that stigmatism that Tebas is this Cadillac. And you know what, we are the Cadillac when it comes to the machining, but Cadillac nowadays doesn't mean it needs to have the price tag right. that, you, that you think of. And that's what a lot of companies are still believing that Tebas is this unattainable solution that companies can't afford. Yes, there's a lot of companies still that are focused only on that black number on the bottom of that quote. That's the only thing they look at. And Cheap is not always the best solution. I would make the discussion that it's never the best solution. Exactly. <laughs> or a very small percentage at best. And, and that's what we're trying to educate individuals to, is if you can save on every single job an hour, two hours, three hours on your machine time, don't you want to have that rather than that one-time cost that you're spending? And saving money on a daily basis that provides a company the ability to buy another machine, to buy, to get another individual that is programming, to give them more work. So Tebis really has leveled the playing field with different license pro licensing products that we offer, that we work with the customer. And one of the things that we really focus a lot on is the customer service. And that's a huge thing nowadays because a lot of our competition have gone towards sales only and support maybe is done maybe outside or has been diminished. We've hired two additional support people because what we wanna do is we wanna have still that family feel. And Tevis is one of the only products still out there that is family owned. Mr. Rindfleisch, our CEO and founder of the company, still runs the company, is still developing software it still has his hands, his fingerprint on the software. Not a lot of software companies in the CAD CAM business can say that nowadays. And it dilutes a little bit that message. And we are still want to stand firm that companies that join with Tebas, they're part of our family. They are sitting at the head of the table along with us. And that's why we want to treat, treat individuals this way. Yeah, thank you for doing that, first of all. I know the audience is also saying thank you, even though we can't currently hear them right now, but thank you for doing that. Yeah. Something else I'd like to emphasize for Michael as well is just the amount of training and then relearning and then retraining and relearning, switching from software to software to software. A Cadillac, right? Mm -hmm. Why not jump into the Cadillac right away and then ride it for a long time? Right. This is the investment of a quote that you guys hear me say all the time is, I'm too poor to buy cheap. I must invest in the, in the nice things. Now, as we bring this to a conclusion, mm -hmm. we, you and I off camera, I do have the gift of having conversations before we hit record <laughs> on this thing, but you and I off camera, you still have people to yeah. say, who is Tevis? What is Tevis? We yeah. started this out to bring a whole full circle of yeah. Yeah. what do you do? But right. let's also explain in a, in a closing statement to the audience out there who goes, well, who is Tevis? And they're learning right now. Who are you? And of 40 years, do you have any, any models, any really powerful 
comments that you'd like to leave with the audience today and let them know this is who we are, this is what we do, this is what 40 Years of Legacy does, this is why we offer you the support and bring people in, and we're still hands-on and paying attention mm -hmm. to you, and this is how we save you money and help you make money simultaneously. Mm -hmm. Tebis is a solution provider of knowledge and technology that you can't find anywhere else. If it comes to machining, all those practices when it comes to machining, if that's turning, if that's milling, if that's five axis milling. And, and today, if you don't have a five axis machine anymore, not yet, let me tell you, you're behind the times. Five axis is what is, is there. And why do companies still do three axis? Because the, some of them are afraid to go towards the five axis. They're, they just have that notion of five axis is complicated. Five axis is slow. Uh, three axes, more rigid machines, that's where I can get my speed up. But if I look at machines, the Hermless, the Focus, the Zimmermans that are out there, they're high-end machines, they're fast as heck. And having the technology that we have built into our system when it comes to five axis milling, along with the simulation capability, because there's something to be said in programming with the actual CNC machine, rather than just doing the simulation after the fact, that gives you real power. Because if I can program with my machine at hand and put collision avoidance with the actual head in place, now I'm, I'm programming with knowledge. And I'm giving software the capability to interact with me as the operator that has a ton of experience and I can give with my software just a little bit that edge that other solutions just can't do. So that's what we provide to our customers is the know-how, the capabilities and at the end of the day, they're benefiting from faster machine time with surface finish that is just out of this world. These types of parts that we have here, they come straight out of the machine. They're not buff, they're not clean. And just think about this in the mold and dye business as well in the aerospace business, where we realize a lot of stuff that's going on. When it comes out of the machine, you don't want to spend hundreds of hours benching, stoning, all this kind of stuff. It needs to come out of the machine perfect. And that's what Tevis provides. We're not calculating on a tessellated model. We're calculating on the actual surface model that you have designed. And let me tell you, if you design crap, you're going to get crap. <laughs> that's just the way it is. Garbage in is garbage out. But if you have the analysis tools that we have that can give you upfront knowledge that you have crap here, you can fix it. We have the abilities to fix it and then give you a model that is just absolutely pristine, that you don't have to spend hundreds of hours of benching, this is where you print money. I don't think it could have been said better by anyone, Michael. I appreciate that. For everyone who's watching right now, there's so many topics that Michael and I don't have the time to talk about. So reach out to Tevis. Small things like your cutting life, cutting tool life lasting longer, doubling, the amount of efficiency, 25% more on average, 90% efficiency. I mean. Really, there's so many topics. So reach out to Tevis, reach out to Michael. We really could talk all day long. Join us for podcasts. Join into that information that will help you succeed. And just like we started this interview, we're going to end it same way. Money. You know you want to make it. And did I get your attention again? Thank you all for watching, Michael. Absolutely incredible. Very calculated and informational as well. Perfect. Thank you. Thanks for all your help. Thanks for what you do with our manufacturing industry. You're a rock star when it comes to machining, manufacturing as a whole. You and your team are stellar. I can't say much better than that. And uh, yeah, look us up. Look us up at tevis.com. Join us on our podcast too. The All Access Podcast was yours truly. So look us up and see how we can help you print money.